Hello, what's up guys, I hope you are doing well, today I gonna show you how to install VMware Workstation Player on Kali Linux. This process also will work on any other Linux operating system such as Ubuntu, Debian, Raspberry Pi, Parrot and more. VMware Workstation Player is a software where you can install any operating system virtually without affecting your main operating system okay guys let's get started okay first of all we have to download vmware workstation player open up any browser okay now type vmware.com in the URL box and press enter. It's official site of vmware. Ok. Now move the cursor to downloads in the navbar. It will show you product downloads list. Ok. Now again move the cursor into the free product downloads. Here in the free product downloads select workstation player. It will open download page. Here is two variant of VMware workstation player. First one is for windows operating system and Second one is for Linux operating system. I am going to download for Linux operating system. Simply click on download button in the Linux download section. Within few seconds download will start. Here simply save the file. By default it will save on downloads folder. Ok, after successfully download, simply close the browser. Ok, now I am going to install VMware Workstation Player in the machine. Open the terminal. Now go to downloads directory. Type cd downloads and press enter. Then type ls and press enter to list all files. Here is the VMware workstation player. Ok, first of all we have to give exclude permission for install VMware workstation player. Type sudo chmod a plus x. Now copy the file name. and paste it here then press enter ok now type dot forward slash and again paste the file name here then press enter it's asking root permission ok don't worry about it now try with sudo type sudo dot forward slash and paste the file name here and then press enter all right you can see installation has been started and it will take a few seconds okay after successfully completed Simply close the terminal. 
or write. Now go to application menu and find VMware player. Okay, here is it. Now simply open it. Here accept the license agreement and click next. Again accept the license agreement and click next. Here if you would like to check for product update on a startup select yes otherwise select no and click next. Here simply select yes and click next. Here if you have a license key select the first one and enter the key otherwise select the second one and click finish. Alright. Now VMware workstation player is ready to use. You can install any operating system in VMware player and use it for different purpose. Okay guys, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.